coaching in Rhode Island, loves living in Narragansett. He thinks it's a fertile basketball area for him to thrive. T.J. Bickerstaff at the top of the key. You dump it in to McLaughlin off the window for an easy two. But make no mistake about it, their identity is going to be defense and then getting into the paint. Rayon Freeman transfer from George Washington hits a three. Almost punched away, waiting seconds of the shot clock. Matson Rebound by McLaughlin. And he's got another two. Uh, to this Rhode Island team. Rhode Island playing the four guards. Leggett hoisting and hitting it. He can hit those acrobatic shots, as we told you in the open. Well, that's going to be the key matchup for Boston College. He averaged close to 20 a game. That's a tough pull-up jumper fading away by Tomorrow. Ish. Damar Lankford just checking in, finds his brother Makai in the post. And Bilal pulls down the rebound for the Rams. Here comes Leggett to Freeman, a fadeaway. Nicely done on the baseline. Uh, I talked about the backcourt matchup in this game, the Rhode Island guard. Transition again for the Rams. What a block for their weak side by Ashton Langford. So Makai Ashton Langford, again, BC late on the transition Rhode Island. They've been impressive uh, early on as you take a look again at another uh, drive uh, by Freeman. Abdu Sam in the game for the Rams wearing one in navy blue. Shot is good. It's a two-pointer this time for Leggett. Kai Ashton Langford keeps alive for Matson a three. And the drought continues. What a pass by Leggett to Freeman for a touchdown. You cannot run transition offense any better. Master Langford gives it back to him, skips a pass to Zachary. Nice move in the paint. Wow! Outstanding body control by Jaden Zach. Ball into the paint right here. Again, this is what Earl Grant talked about. Don't settle for that jumper. Get into the paint, higher percentage shot. And that's a beautiful offense by Boston College. That's a difficult reverse layup, though, by Zayden and Zachary. Eagles with some nuke foul life. Triggers on defense. Ashton Lakeford down the lane for the lay-in and the foul. And then one. Makai Ashton Lakeford, the steal and the transition score. Freeman, five for eight from the field. He has 11 points to lead all scores. And a steal. Look out. Here comes Joseph Palau with power. Four-star recruit out of Houston. Kelly, nifty dribbling. The runner is good. Boy, if he can give him that on a couple of occasions, that would be beneficial. Cincinnati to be a consistent three-point shooter. They didn't have that last year outside of Jaden Zachary. Elbow jumper by Ashton Lake. Uh, they struggle, don't shoot a high percentage. So again, when you get into conference play, you're going to need guys to be able to knock down some perimeter shots. Good take by Brayon Freeman. He is aggressive, Malcolm. He gets going between the circles. He's tough to slow down downhill. C.J. Pena, lifty up and under and swatted out of bounds. The big fella showing a handle. Have to keep up with the Joneses, that's for sure. Jaden Zachary down the lane, harassed and punched away. Sebastian Thomas, he's out of Providence. The teardrop is good, that was pretty. Guarded by Zachary, now Ashton Lankford on Thomas. Zips a pass in the lane for Chiku. Good weak side defense again by T.J. Bickerstaff out of bounds. And after the game, head back to ACC Network for a complete game breakdown with coach and player interviews. You can always watch on the ESPN app if you're out and about because nobody covers the ACC. Freeman waiting stages of the shot clock. Look out. Leggett launches. Got it. What a shot. Ish Leggett takes it baseline on Zachary. And a steal by Pena, ill-advised pass. Zachary the lob, and the lay-in for Devin McLaughlin. Well done by Zachary and McLaughlin. Zachary hounding him, the screen, and a steal by Ashton Lankford. Finds Zachary with time, and he lays it in. Outstanding defense by the Eagles. Can't keep it alive, it's saved by Madsen. Here come the Eagles. Like a blur in the front court. Ashton Lake for three for Zachary. He got it. First three-pointer of the game for BC. BC matching 
Eighth largest lead of the game. Here comes Bickerstaff with a drive. The put back by Pena. Now it's the largest lead for the Eagles, and Archie Miller wants a timeout. Rayon Freeman. Chiku snap, snaps that string. Delivered Eagles offense and a steal. Here comes Malik Martin. Martin down the lane. Runner got it. They're riding a mini 4 0 run. A Boston College, 10 points off the turnovers, six for Rhode Island. Mason Matson the three. Rebound. Bickerstaff, the foot mark, and an M1. My goodness, T.J. Bickerstaff, first two points of the game, memorable. Again, uh, Makai Aston Langford in transition. That's a wide open three. Freeman, the take and the make. Four point lead, Tamar Langford walks across the timeline. It's a back from Zachary, and he's got two. 33% for the game. Back door, Malik Martin. The lay-in, a Charlotte transfer. Tamar Lankford. Blocked by Malik Martin. And the 50-50 win for the Rams. Here they come with Ish Leggett. And he gives them the lead in an N1. Drive and a block. Good. Catch up defense by Makai Ashton Langford. Shooting percentages URI 34%, BC 30%. Sebastian Thomas got it. He hit that one from Providence. Zachary the high dribble. Damar Langford the take and the make. Off the bounce for Damar Langford. Boston College back in the matchup zone. Rayon Freeman, you know it. Problems at the line for the Rams now. If I'm Boston Collins, I'm putting Makai Aston and Flankford with the ball. Let him make a play just like that. To Devin McLaughlin, end off Ashton Lankford. Oh, wide open, McLaughlin, the beneficiary. Good call, Malcolm. Devin McLaughlin, he's an X-factor for the Eagles. He has nine. Leggett, the take. Balao trying to put back, along with Weston. They missed some bunnies. Double T for Leggett, no. Kept alive, Leggett tracks it down. 85%, a reminder coming up next. East Carolina at number five, Virginia. The Cavaliers have been rolling. Star for the Cavs, used to play at East Carolina. Zachary, one of two. Freeman. Wow, nifty dribbling rebound, McLaughlin, and a foul in the backcourt. For Devin McLaughlin, you and I talked about it. He's going to be instrumental for BC this year. They're going to need him, especially on the defensive end. Uh, will he go and choose to decide to foul in this situation? Rogaret says no foul in the front court. Three by Leggett, no. Rolling out of bounds, and that does it. A gritty win for Boston College.